National Health Insurance Employers. In Romania, the National Health Insurance has and health system is functional and the problems that emerged in the first days of current system implementation were due to the fact that part of multiple service providers used the card for the first time, although they had previously had a period of training in this respect. Dr. Mera Simeon brings you more on this issue in a report by Cody Mokrista. Daily reports show that the health card system in place in Romania since May 1st was not functional. And every day, more and more people benefit from medical services based on this card. The health ministry communicates explaining that a great part of medical service providers and the insured patients have understood the need and importance of implementing the health card system, which alongside the e-recipe and the e-file are major objectives in the process of digitizing the health system. All these measures are part of a project of financial control and discipline in the health insurance system. But there are people who oppose this project. And to put order in the system and stop fraud, the health ministry representatives added, the card's electronic memory includes such data as the name and last name of the insured person, a unique code of identification in the health insurance database, the identification number of the national health insurance card, the date of birth and the validity period of the card, which is five years. Upon request by the insured person, the family doctor can offer medical data on the card. Doctors and pharmacists alike from across Romania have criticized the awkward functioning of the health card system. Many insured people have not yet received their health card, and televisions have reported for days on end about the general chaos created by the health card in Romania. In a debate on Radio Romania, the president of the National Health Insurance House, Vasile Turka, recalled that the health authorities had informed patients and learned in advance that they could use a card. But family doctors are not willing to activate their cards. Prime Minister Victor Ponta says the introduction of the health card system will generate important savings for the state adding that efforts will continue to stop fraud in the medical system. The health card increased savings of at least 300 million euros in 2006 down into any well-stay within the health system. As long as I am Prime Minister, tax evasion has to be fought against in a respectable package of opinions. I'll do my best to fight this matter to the end for Romania. The Prime Minister's statements come after last weekend. The Romanian President Klaus Johannes criticized the government for the flawed manner in which it implemented the health card system. Rallies were held in Romania at the weekend in an attempt to bring the BC Digital Street Center on hold. But another more than new policy has been submitted to the Chamber of Deputies for debate at the request of President Klaus Johannes. And Radio Nasrio, Diana Bozo brings you further details in a report by Mihai Pelin. Rallies to protect forests were organized in Bucharest and other big cities across Romania the weekend. Under the slogan, Together We Can Stop the Massacre of Forests, thousands of people, also the representatives of 27 NGOs from both Romania and abroad, took to the street to protest against deforestation and to call on the authorities to make Romania's forests national priority. The protest is legitimate, considers Romania's President Klaus Johannes, who has held a new party contract to Parliament for a discussion. The document will be re-debated by the Chamber of Deputies this week. When the government has seen that the final vote will be able to prevent, fight and penalize illegal logging and break the monopoly held by any particular company. In his request, the Romanian